Hi, I'm Dr. Greg Gillespie. I'm a general dentist in Vancouver, Washington. And my expert tip for today is to incorporate injectable, flowable resin veneers into your smile design process. You know, when it comes to smile designs, not every patient wants porcelain veneers, you know, either because they want to be more conservative or because of cost, they're looking for another alternative. Resin veneers are an option, but as you and I both know, layering even just one resin veneer, when you're getting all the layers right, the lingual shelf, dentin, enamel, the effects, and it, I mean, it can take hours, especially if you're doing two or four or six, I mean, it can be really difficult. And also getting just all the right shapes, very, very hard. One of the things that I've found to improve predictability is actually using this technique that's becoming more popular of injectable resin veneers. Let me explain how it works for me. What I do in the wax up process, I design it almost like you're going to do porcelain veneers, right? In the wax up process with your laboratory. And then they send back the wax up in addition, a clear putty matrix with a hard clear shell that you can just bore holes up through the incisal edges of each of the teeth. And then you isolate the tooth, you do your bonding process, you put that shell right over it, and you inject the flowable resin right into it, and then you cure right through it. Take it off, do the cleanup on the one, and then move right to the next one. The results are actually way better than I anticipated. I've been doing it quite a bit now, and it's been, uh, I mean, patients are absolutely loving it. One thing I found, using the newest, highest quality of flowable resins. Today, they've made them much stronger, much more durable, much more aesthetic than ever before. And so now it's an option for a final restoration. They polish beautifully. And as you get that perfect finish on that single injectable flowable resin veneer, you'll be amazed at how great it looks. And so this can be a great option. You know, one thing I've done is I've actually done maybe two or four veneers, and then I've done a couple of injectable resin flowable, flowable veneers in addition to some porcelain or just all injectable flowable. And I mean, it's almost like it opens up a whole new realm of possibility by incorporating this new idea of how we can do smile design. Try it out, talk to your lab about it. I know it can work for you too. Hope this helps.